Hey billionaires, as you can tell by the title, this is a video addressing the hype behind the nail shop has died down. And what I mean by that is I believe they have equally all decided to get over on us. And by that, I mean, they just do the bare minimum and they charge entirely too much. I believe they've started to add their tip into the prices about how much they want to be paid. And that's fine. But for those of us who, hold on, I'm getting ready for the day as well. But for those of us who pay good enough tips, that is going overboard, especially when your nails are going to look like this. See those chips? Um, in less than a day. So I got my nails done for my birthday and um, I noticed the moment I walked out, maybe like a, no more than 30 minutes later, possibly like maybe even sooner than that, like 10 minutes later, I was sitting in the car because my mama was still editing her video. And I said, I looked at this nail to be specific, this one, I'm not trying to flip y'all off, but I looked at this one to be specific and she said something to me, the nail shop lady, she's the owner, the lady who did my toes, fine, they, she did fine, nothing is wrong with my toes, but this is the owner now that we're talking about it um now we're moving on to my fingers the owner did my fingers another lady did my toes so i moved on to her and she said um make sure you put your fingers all the way in your thumbs your thumbs i mean make sure you put your thumbs all the way in the little dryer because everybody goes home and come back and say their nails are chipped. So I'm not thinking nothing of it. I've been going to the nail shop since I was a very small child. I know how the nail shop works. I know how to put my fingers in the dryer. And especially if I have gel nails. So I get my service is gel and French tip. I really don't care about the price, but when my, I normally don't complain. Even if I don't like them, I don't complain. I have, um, I'm impatient when it comes to the nail shop. I'm not impatient to where I'm just like ready to go. I'm impatient to like, let me sit down, get this service done because I want my nails to be cute. That type of impatient. So when she said, everybody goes home and complain, I'm like, oh, I'm going to be good because I've been sticking my nails all the way in. I didn't like how she did them so bubbly to like make them jump at you. I want them to just be like, my nails are done. Like that, not <sighs> my nails are done. So anyways, when she said that, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna be good. I noticed like there was a little hair. It looked like hair, but it, looking for uh, deeper into it, you can tell that it was a crack. So there was a crack in that nail. Fast forward to the day I leave for my trip. <laughs> Um, no, the day before I leave for my trip, I noticed the thumbs are chipping in the corner. I can't never find where the camera lens is. The thumbs were chipping in the corner. Then I started to notice like they did not go all the way across. They did not, she did not go all the way across with polishing. She stopped like it's not polished all the way across. Y'all probably can't see that, but I went on my trip. I did just perfectly fine on my trip for what I needed my nails done for. And not only that, sometimes we just need our nails done to like relax and stuff. But I went on my trip, I came back, My all of my nails were chipped. At this point they're off. And y'all know when you take gel off or you can't really take gel off but when it comes off it come it's it's like hard scratchy surface my nail is completely clean like i don't know how to explain this other than it's just like you lay a piece of tape down and peel it up that's exactly what happened to my nails i feel like a piece of tape was laid down and then you pull it up. That's how clean it is. Gel is hard to come off. You cannot get it off with 
fingernail polish you have to have drills and like files and i don't have none of that here i don't have none of that here even if i did i normally like for days i'll peel 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 when i know i'm not going to the nail shop no more but i didn't have to do anything it peeled up on its own moral of the story i went back a day after i got back i said hey i went inside i told them i said so the lady she seen me she was you know helping the customer that was booking an appointment and she seen me she like oh shoot i knew she was going to be back that was the look on her face she knew i was going to be back she knew i was going to be back so i then the man he was sitting down on, in the chair at the door he was like what happened what happened so i started to tell him and then she you know she couldn't wait to finish the customer she leaned around the customer and then when i said i did this i said I came, she said, okay, okay, hold on, wait, 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 wait. The lady left out, another black lady. She left out. Um, I then proceeded to explain to her, you told me everybody comes back and complain that their nails are chipping. My nails are off. I have these, uh-oh, I have these left and some of my thumb and they're chipped. She said, just... Just come on, we gonna help you, we gonna do it now. I said, no, I don't have time now. I'll be back Friday. Today is Friday. I'm going to get my nails done um, again. And if they come up again, keep in mind, gel is supposed to last at least a month. Uh, from experience, my gel has lasted a month. A month. And I'm not expecting everybody to do the same thing, but when my nails look like this, in less than a week, like I said, when I got to her, it was a week. When I went back, it was a week. My nails were chipping the very moment I sat in that car, but I was too um, busy prepping for my trip that I could not, I could not go back. I could not go back. I dealt with it. It was still withable, but then, you know, and I have not done anything. I don't do extensive work. I don't do anything with my fingers. So it's not my fingers. I don't know what the difference is between why my feet are lasting and why my fingers aren't, but I feel like it's the owner. Sometimes we need to retire after a certain amount of time. I'm going to check back in with y'all when I get to the nail shop because I have to go. But this is really irritating, the fact that I paid them more than enough money and a tip. And a tip. And a tip. And a tip. I won't be going back to the nail shop. <laughs> With that being said, I'm going to do my own nails from here on out. Now you guys look at those nails and tell me what is wrong with them. Take one grand fabulous look and see how they're cutting the corners. She's her excuse. She was real nice. She's a nice woman. Her excuse is sometimes the nail bed is oily. That's why they peel up. Gel does not come up at all. At all. She's talking about some. She's not gonna let me wash my nail, wash my hands this time, and see if that works. And still telling me to pull, push my fingers all the way in. My fingers are dang near burnt from pushing them so far in. I know how this works. And that concludes this video, y'all. I'm cracking up. Me and my mama cracking up because. Honestly, I don't really think she knows what she's doing, but she talking about she's been here for 18 years, and I'm trying to be respectful, but if she's telling me she'll see me in two to three weeks, you won't see me at all, because at, at the very least, the other nail shops, they get over on you, but they at least know what they're doing, and it lasts longer. A gel treat, I mean, whatever it's called, the gel process is supposed to last at least a month and the fact that it didn't last 10 minutes mm -hmm. is not okay and with that being said i'm gonna be doing my own nails from here on out 
I got to add one more thing. My mama said that was real fast. You know why? Because I had only been in there getting this done for at least five minutes. Five minutes at the at the most. You came out so fast made my head swim. And I'm not lying. I, that is not a lie. I've been in there for five minutes. And then she talking about she was busy all day. I came at the great, uh, the perfect time and she been looking for me. Oh, she said she was gonna come back Friday. I'm gonna be back. Cause all my, I went in there with no nails, none. And she looked at them, I said, yeah, they end up all coming off. So I'm here with blank nails. Give me a fresh full set. You're not fixing one or two, you're fixing all 10.